All right, you ready? Mm -hmm. Does my hat look good? Oh, it's that term. Good term. Oh my god! My leg! <laughs> For makeup? Yeah, go, go, go. Okay. Ready. We're live! <laughs> Welcome to Main Street Mowers What's in a Box. Today we're reviewing the new Steel Smart Connect. Pretty interesting product, guys. I wanted to talk to you about it. It's released in Europe. It's not available in the US yet. It's coming out very soon. And let me tell you all about what this product can do for you and your landscape crew uh, and why somebody like you might want something like this. It's a very interesting device. It's very sleek, very cool. What does it do for you? I'm pretty excited about this product. I've been testing it for about five weeks now. It's a very interesting and cool tool for landscapers when it comes to managing their crew and managing their equipment and being aware of what's going on. And I think that's maybe a big issue landscapers have is awareness. You know, how much is my guy working? How much is this piece of equipment working before it breaks? Where is my equipment? Um, what are my model and serial numbers? Because my equipment has been stolen. I need to have a track of that. Um, all those little things uh, are going to be really a lot easier to manage when you, if you have one of these devices. So basically what is this? What is the Steel Smart Connect? It's basically a little Bluetooth hour meter that connects to your anything that has an electrical signal. It can attach to your battery powered units, it can attach to your gas powered units, it can attach to your lawn mowers, to your trucks, to your ATVs. It's super well made, has a nice 3M adhesive back, it has mounting holes for rivets or for self-tapper screws, all that's included in the package. Feels very good, waterproof, nice o-ring. Anyways, what this does is you attach it to a piece of equipment. Say you attach it to your blower. And basically every time that unit is ran, this counts how many minutes it was run. And anytime you come near your app, it sends a Bluetooth signal to your phone and tells, the, tells your phone, hey, that BR800 has run 10 minutes today, or an hour today, or two hours today. I can attach this to a unit and put it in my phone as a new item. Basically, as it hits different service intervals that Steel has for each of its units, it will be kind of alerted on your phone. Hey, your blower is due for a fuel filter. Your, your blower is due for an air filter. Your blower is due for a spark plug. So it's gonna keep track of those things for you. So that's one aspect. It's gonna help you maintain your equipment so that you can be proactive rather than reactive in repairs. Because if you forget to change your spark plug, it might not work one day and you're not gonna be able to blow off that old lady's driveway and she might be mad at you and drop you as a landscaper. But if you had that spark plug in there already and it's not gonna shut off that day, you're not gonna have any issues, then less downtime. So that's one aspect of this Steel Smart Connect I think is pretty neat. You know, if you're a single owner operator and you only got one weeder, you know, you could just check it every week. But say you got a crew of, you know, 10 people, you got a crew of 50 people, or a crew of 100 people, how helpful would it be if your crew leaders could keep track of all of your equipment and your service intervals for all your stuff from his phone instantly and know, hey, this whole truck will it worth of steel equipment needs to be serviced. Or you could even put this on your Echo. You could put this on your Shindawa. You could put this on anything. But it is a steel product and it uses a steel app, but you can put it on any item and you can create your own custom service intervals also if you didn't want to use steels. I have it on a grandstand. It tells me how many hours I've ran it so that when I see I've been demoing it and it's been 50 hours, I know to bring it in for an oil change. So this has been helping me keep track of that, keep track of my own unit. So here, that's one aspect, is keeping track of service. The other aspect that it helps you with is location. Uh, it's not a GPS. I repeat, this is not a GPS. This is a Bluetooth device that pings to your phone. So basically, whenever you are near your phone, it alerts your phone and it links with it wirelessly. You don't have to push any buttons, you don't have to do anything. And basically, every time you walk past your truck, walk past your trailer, walk past your shop, it's going to update your phone with all the info on it and it's going to update its last location that it pinged your phone. So, why is that helpful? Imagine your crew is at a big property and it's a couple acres and you have a guy just doing hedge trimming way, way back. And he gets thirsty, he puts his hedge trimmer down, he goes up to the truck, 
and he gets a drink of water. Then somebody asks him, hey, will you edge? He edges and he gets back on the truck and you guys all leave. Well, your head trimmer's back on that property. Well, if you were to look at your phone, look at the app, you can push a button and it'll tell you, one, what's on your truck or what's near you at the moment. So before you leave the property, you could tell, is this trimmer on my truck or is it on the yard? And say you drive a couple miles down the road and you pull out your phone and you check your inventory, it'll show you the last time it pinged your phone. So it'll say, hey, the hedge trimmer's still back at that last big property at the end of that hedge laying on the ground. So you can go back there and grab it before you lose it. Um, I think that's a really important thing. It's gonna save a lot of people losing equipment, save a lot of people money and a lot of time. Um, it's going to be a very helpful part. They made it so you can assign units to different teams, you can assign units to different, uh, different statuses, so if like a unit is down, your crew leader can select that unit and change it down to inoperable. Basically telling himself or maybe his boss, hey I got a down unit and it'll be easy to find later for him to take it into his shop to get it repaired. That's a helpful tool so that you know the status of all your equipment at all the time. I think an interesting aspect is we're gonna be able to see what are the run times on these two-stroke units, on these on these steel weed eaters, on the blowers. Like, how many hours do you actually get out of a BR600 before it blows up or before you need to replace it? Um, how much run time between your last repair and the future repair that it needs? You'll be able to say, hey, that head only lasts me 12 hours. That'd be a big deal. And so it's gonna be helpful with just repair shops and keeping more accuracy and, and what we're doing and how the equipment's holding up. It's gonna help landscapers realize, is this equipment lasting as long as it should? Are the repairs lasting as long as they should? And another thing is you can actually select a service shop to link these two as well. So say you're a customer of Main Street Mower and you have your fleet of 20 hedge trimmers uh, all with the steel smart connects we'll be able to see your run times and your service intervals. Basically, this has a graph with different timelines. So when it hits 100 hours, do this. When it hits 200 hours, do this. When it hits 300 hours, do this. And whether you do it or not, it's up to you. It's just a helpful remember, uh, just a helpful guide to remember by, you know, hey, I should have blown out my cooling fins. And maybe you've never done that before. Maybe your units lasted a long time, but how long would it last if you actually followed Steele's recommended service intervals? I'm curious to see. If somebody who owns a Steel Connect unit, if their unit will last longer than a guy who's never serviced it at all. Another aspect I think is helpful is team awareness. Team awareness, if say you have a dedicated string trimmer and edger guy, and you have a dedicated mower guy, and a dedicated blower guy, You'd be able to tell how many minutes each guy's working per job per day if you had one of these units on here. So you would know if I need to hire an extra string trimmer guy because he's working twice as hard as my blower guy. Or you would know if you needed to buy more string trimmers than edgers because you're string trimming way more often. Um, so those are little helpful things. It'll help you actually manage the minutes that your guys are actually cutting grass. And that's crazy because you can't do that usually unless you're there. And even still, they might be hiding behind the bushes or something, and this won't lie. You just walk by their piece of equipment and it'll update your phone. He spent three minutes edging that property, and you know very well that that property needs 30 minutes of edging. And you could say, hey, you just did it, you skipped it this week, you need to go back and finish edging. Or you can say, hey, you're fired. You're fired! Uh, I've installed five of these now. Installation is very easy. Basically has an adhesive back, you peel off, you stick it near an electrical device on the unit. You can just stick it on the orange shroud on a blower or trimmer. And they have some self tappers that you could actually take the shroud off and screw from the inside out. Or I just screwed them from the outside in. Both worked fine. And I know that just this sticky Glue on the back is enough to hold it on there. Like even if you didn't put screws on it, I guarantee this thing's not coming off. I mean, this thing's gonna be on for life. But if you did uh, want to take this off a blown up unit or something, you could peel it off, scrape it off, and then you could use just the mounting bolts from then on to mount it to new pieces of equipment in the future, which would be pretty helpful. It has a battery life that lasts about a year, year and a half is what I've been told. It's just kind of like a watch battery. You put a quarter in here, they give you a little tool, you loosen this quarter turn and this cap pops off and you can take the battery in and out. 
It's very easy to do. When they come, the battery's in it already. There's just a little piece of plastic between the battery and the little piece of metal. You take the cover off, you take the battery out, you take the piece of plastic out, put the battery back in, put the cover back on, and you're ready to go. So now we're gonna go into the phone and kind of show you how easy setup is and the usability of the app. We're not gonna do an in-depth how to set it up, uh, but we'll kind of give you a brief summary. It's really self-explanatory and it's very, very simple. So I'm gonna open up my app here. Here's my home screen. It has a nice little icon. It's just called Connected. It has a little interesting circle. You click it and you have a home screen with all your units listed on it. It has your current hours ran on all the units. It has their current status on them. If it's operable, inoperable. And then you can click locations at the top. It could tell you where your last time you pinged it was, when was the last time you were near your unit. So all five of mine are in the building somewhere, so they're all showing up at our current location here in Winter Garden, Florida. And it's pretty accurate within you know 50 feet. So, but it's not live. It only updates when you ping off your Bluetooth. So it's not like if someone steals it, you can go track them down and uh, be like that movie Taken or whatever. I will look for you. I will find you. And then they have a center button here, and it actually has like a proximity. Are you within 50 feet of your unit? So this would be if you're sitting in your truck and you're wondering, do I have everything on my trailer? You could push this button and it would tell you everything is nearby or nothing's nearby. Um, to add a new product, there's a little button at the bottom that says add product, you click it. And then it says, yes, scan or enter serial number. So if it's a steel product, Basically, you click that button and it opens up your camera and you hover it over a, basically on all the steel logos, there is a, a little QR code and it'll autofill all the information on that product. Say it's a BR600, you hit that little scanner, you scan your barcode, bam, that product's entered, model, serial, and then inside the actual little tracking device or the hour meter device, underneath the battery is its own little barcode and it'll say scan barcode, you scan that, beep, and it links the two. At that point, it's set up. Put your battery back in, it'll automatically recognize it in your phone. And from then on, you have them two linked. That simple. It's really, really quick process. Uses of this are so endless, guys. It can be used by fleet managers, by owners, by crew leaders, by drivers, by individual users, by homeowners, by Anybody who wants to keep track of hours on the unit, and say you have a lawnmower even, it doesn't have an hour meter. This little device can be installed on your mower and you can keep track of your hours and do oil changes and maintenance really accurately and never have to worry about anything. It just, just works, just automatically, it's an app on your phone. It's that simple. Um, you're probably asking, Chip, how much does it cost? This device does too much good stuff. It must cost tons of money. And though Steel hasn't released the official price price in US, it's going to be sub $30. From what I've heard, it's going to be underneath $30 uh, per unit. And that's pretty amazing. I mean, I think the value this adds to your business and productivity and uh, just if this prevented you from losing one unit one time, $30, I mean, that's nothing. That's, that's peanuts. You're not going to find many reviews on these yet, just because they're not available yet in the US. Uh, in Europe, I think, has been testing them. I'm not even sure if they're officially selling them. I could be wrong about that. Uh, but it's something you're going to see soon in a shop near you. And I would say pick you up a couple. I think they're going to offer it in singles and a multi-pack. Uh, it's going to change the way you run your business. It's going to change the way you manage your equipment. You're going to have less unpredictable downtime. You're going to be able to service your units when it's effective and useful to you. You know, you can have your units in for repair during your vacation rather than during your busy season. Uh, so those are little things that I think this is going to help you do. Uh, guys, thanks for watching. Check out the new Steel Smart Connect. Look out for it, guys. It's coming down the pipe. Go get you some at Main Street Mower. Subscribe to our channel. Check out some of our other videos. I hope you enjoyed watching. Have a great day.